Hey, behind me is the uh, Great Basin National Park here in Nevada. And maybe you heard what was recently found up in these hills. If you haven't heard, this is pretty exciting, especially if you love guns like I do. But some archaeologists found an old Winchester lever-action rifle leaning up against a tree. Been there for decades, maybe even 100 years or more. But what they found was an 1873 actually a model 1873 Winchester lever action rifle. They was able to run the serial number and the gun was made in 1882. 1882, same year Jesse James was assassinated, so you know that rifle dates back to the Old West here in Nevada. But the gun chambered in 4440. They said it was empty when they found it, so who knows what happened. A deer hunter maybe set it down. Maybe an outlaw was shooting at the posse and ran out of ammo and put his gun down and picked up his Colt revolver. Who knows? But the gun right now is in Baker, Nevada. It's going to be at the visitor center for just a couple hours today. So I'm going to go down there and take some video. And then they're going to ship it off. And they're going to get it back sometime next year. And it's going to be on permanent display in the visitor center in Baker, Nevada sometime in 2016. So if you ever get up this way, go in and check out that rifle sometime starting next year. And if you do get up here, make sure you plan a trip to the Lehman Caves because they're just a few miles right behind me. So anyways, let's get down and take a look at that rifle because I'm pretty excited about this. So Eva, how'd you uh, find the rifle? Um, the, the win this is so. This is the Winchester 1873 model, mm -hmm. and um, it was found in November when we were doing an archaeological survey. Um, anytime the park does a project that might disturb historic or archaeological sites, we go out and check things out first. Um, and so we record artifacts and anything that we find and uh, so in the process of doing that things we find. Did you sit down and take a break and look over? Or? I kind of had to stop and let my heart slow down. Oh I bet. <laughs> we actually had just had a lunch break and so we were kind of just taking it easy and uh, I went down to look around some rocks in a rocky outcrop and went around a tree and there it was. Made in 1882, huh? Correct. Let me kind of help. And, and, okay, so sets, it sets like right on that plate. Yeah, there. Yeah, the, do you want me to switch it for a Probably should get some of that. Can I check it in here? It's like a simple gun, but it certainly was something that was important to people then. The model 1873. Um, but we couldn't see the serial number at the time. Mm -hmm. it takes a right right angle light to, to be able to read it. So, right. Yeah, and we were able to, we contacted the Buffaloville Museum in Cody that holds the records. And uh, they were able to give us just that little bit of information. And I said, but do you know who it was sold to? And they said, no, that couldn't tell just you the that. records we have. We just don't know. So part of the reason for uh, like having this viewing and and you know putting the story out was to see yeah. if we anybody like would show up and say hey my great great grandpa we have family records and that would be pretty cool it would be we'll do this to like a smaller piece so do you know much about Winchester rifles. Because, see, I'm just going to mine the people that come. <laughs> so we just, we go out and we just get in a line and we all walk back and forth. This time it was like up and down, up and down. But, um, so we were just doing our job. Routine survey. Routine right? survey. And uh, we actually had just stopped to have lunch. And I, so who, gets, who gets credit for finding it? Um, 
We all do. <laughs> no, I, I did. You but did. yeah, yeah. Well, we were, cool thing. you know, I can forget things. This may be the apex of your career. It may have, and I'll tell you, it's not ever what I expected that <laughs> would be. <laughs> the company records indicate there were um, over 25,000 made. That same model that Jimmy Stewart had? Yep. That yeah. The connection? Yeah. Yeah. And the so movie? that Jimmy Stewart movie, right. um, the movie was made in 1950, right. but it's about about a Winchester, and it's kind of the same thing we're looking for, is the Winchester yeah. like goes from place to place and kind of has its own story, but you get to know. Same, right all the way to the end of, in the park. Uh, are those roads open? Um, no, the road up to Wheeler Peak is not. Okay. There's too much snow. You can okay. go up into the park um, right. as far as Lehman, Maybe. Upper oh, Lehman, Lehman Camp Lehman. Ground. Okay. You okay. want them to get out and park and, yeah. and then hike up the road. But yeah. it's not. It's quite a hike. <laughs> like, like I said, this is so overwhelming. But the, yeah. you know, one of the great well, outcomes is all because we call it yeah. looking for that on the Facebook page. Yeah. Yeah. So, there's been a lot more reviewing of everything else. This is one of those things.